you're thinking of moving to Moreno Valley, I'm gonna give you guys some pros and cons of what to expect when you move into this town. We're gonna to start with the pros. The first thing off the list is it's the second largest city in the entire Riverside County. They're trying to go ahead and industrialize this city rapidly and provide a lot of housing for the surrounding areas. Speaking of which, we roll into quote unquote affordable housing. Obviously, this is technically still considered suburban area, so you're gonna get lower prices than as you would Orange County or LA. The other thing is you are an hour, roughly an hour distance from San Diego, LA, Orange County, all these surrounding areas where there's a lot of things that you can go do. In the city though, we have what's called Lake Paris, man-made lake where you can go ahead and do jet ski rentals, boat rentals, barbecues, Camp, you can actually camp there and they have hiking trails as well. So Myrna Valley has a lot of hills, right? And a lot of places to explore, which provide great opportunities if you're an outdoor person to go hike. We do have great schools here with great education and great athletic programs, right? There's a couple schools here in town that are known for their football teams. And then also some academic schools known for sending students off to high prestigious universities as well. And this one can be a give or take depending on your personal preference. We do get to experience seasons all year round. Hot summers, right? Expect it at least in the 90s. Sometimes it'll reach a little bit above 100. But we also do get cold winters as low as 30 degrees in the nighttime. Sometimes it even snows once in a while. The cons are, like I said, the city's growing rapidly because of industrialization. There's actually a lot of warehouses here being built because the whole purpose of Myrna Valley in the future is gonna to be to go ahead and convert it as to an outsourced distribution city. Because there's a lot of big rigs, semis, trailers, logistics stuff, you're gonna get a lot of traffic in town. Because of the traffic, you're gonna have two things, increase in rent and increase in auto insurance. The city's police department is actually sponsored by the sheriff's department. So response times tend to be a little bit more behind than other places. There's actually not too many things to do if you're not so much of a, I would say this t this town is more family oriented and more like of an outdoor person who doesn't mind traveling a little bit to go experience new things. So there's not a lot of things to do here in this town. We do have the lake, we do have the, a mall, and then a new town center that's gonna be built, all of this stuff. But if, it's, if that's not really your thing and you're more of like the city life, this probably may not be for you. But that's a pros and cons list of Myrna Valley. Take it as you will. If you plan on moving here, you know, I highly suggest you come check it out first. And don't, don't forget to follow me on Instagram as well.